Today, we are providing the information that an individual traveling from Liberia has been diagnosed with Ebola in the United States. This individual left Liberia on the 19th of September, arrived in the U.S. on the 20th of September, had no symptoms when departing Liberia or entering this country, but four or five days later, around the 24th of September, began to develop symptoms. On the 26th of September, initially sought care, and Sunday, the 28th of September, was admitted to a hospital in Texas and placed on isolation. The next steps are basically um, threefold. First, to care for the patient. Second, we identify all people who may have had contact with the patient while he could have been infectious. And remember, Ebola does not spread from someone who's not infectious. It does not spread from someone who doesn't have fever and other symptoms. Once those contacts are all identified, they're all monitored for 21 days after exposure to see if they develop fever. The bottom line here is that I have no doubt that we will control this importation or this case of Ebola so that it does not spread widely in this country.